All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Hayden with State 48 Turtle and Taurus. Got an interesting video for you today. As you guys saw the thumbnail title, should you rescue a tortoise? We're gonna go ahead and jump right into that, but first I gotta go ahead and grab the tortoise we're talking about. All right, guys, what we have here is a baby sulcata tortoise. We're gonna, we're gonna come back to him in a second. I'm gonna let him crawl around a little bit. But guys, this is kind of crazy. The guy who used to live in this house had sulcata tortoises, um, but it's been like, I've owned the house for a year and it's been, it was almost a year and a half that he had had the tortoises here. And these neighbors behind me said that they found the tortoises about a year ago. They found three baby tortoises in their backyard. Uh, they were walking along the fence line back there and they grabbed them and raised them up for a year. And they said, you know what? We're not the best fit. They literally just screamed at me. I was out, I was in the yard working on all my plumbing and dealing with the tortoises. And they literally, hey neighbor, you know, so I ran over and this one, she'd already pushed through the fence. And then she basically, long story short, cause I can talk a lot guys. I am a talker. I don't know what happened to me. Basically what she said was, there were three of them. They've raised them for the past year. They've been fine, healthy. Obviously they're pretty small. They're a little dry, whatever. But basically what she said is, they've got these two new dogs and the dogs got to them. As you can tell, this turtle has a bite mark, bite mark. They said they're pretty sure the dogs for sure ate one. It bit on this one and there's another third one that either already walked through the fence into my backyard because they just pushed it through the fence so it could be safe from the dogs or the dogs got it completely. So I'm gonna go search around, see if I can find that baby turtle. We're gonna get this guy soaking and then I'm gonna work on cleaning him up and getting his wounds cleaned up. But I think he's gonna be fine, make a full recovery. But guys, should you rescue a baby turtle or tortoise? Yes, and I'm gonna tell you why I think you should rescue a baby turtle or tortoise in any circumstance. I'm gonna get this guy soaking. All right, guys, we are gonna get this guy soaking. You can tell, I mean, this is an old tortoise. I mean, it's gotta be at least a year, year and a half old. It's been through a lot in its life. Um, it's not soft, it's actually, they did a decent job raising it. I think they literally just left it outside all year and let it do its thing, but um, I'm gonna let it soak for a little bit. I'm gonna go look around for that other tortoise just to make sure it hasn't gotten too far from that area over there. Um, I actually caught two or three of the box turtles out earlier today. I planted a bunch of random crap seeds in there. There's a little tree thing growing, but box turtles are all doing good. Water turtles here, pretty good sliders are getting huge. They hide all the time. You can see one of them poking his little head out right there. They hide all the time. This lizard, he got out in this room and I have not seen him in over a week. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. So I don't know where he is. He got out, but I've been leaving water and food out for him. So we'll see what happens, but I'm gonna go look around for that turtle. I'll catch you guys in a jiffy talk about why I think you should definitely always say yes to rescuing a turtle and tortoise. All right, there's some turtles just swam in there. This guy's been soaking for a good 20 minutes. I did not find any other turtles wandering around out there. I'm gonna clean up his shell a little bit, but just wanted to wrap up this video real quick, guys. My office is a mess. The reptile room is a friggin' mess. Real quick before I forget, click like on this video if you haven't done so so far, and definitely subscribe if you're new to the channel, because a lot of banger content coming soon as you can tell my yards in freaking shambles because we got a lot of stuff coming um successful breedings have been happening with the albino sulcatas big stuff they're bringing you why do i think that you should definitely rescue a turtle or tortoise if presented the opportunity number one if you're rescuing it most likely it's because it's in a bad circumstance i'm not gonna say every time some people take really good care of their turtles but if you're rescuing a turtle or a tortoise, you're taking it from a worse circumstance that you can potentially make better yourself or you can potentially find someone else who will make it better. Because I'll tell you what happens a lot of times. People say, oh, I'm done with my turtle or tortoise. And they ask their friend or neighbor who knows nothing about turtles and tortoises, hey, I need to rehome this. Are you interested? And they say, sure, yep, whatever. And it goes on to live another not so great life, right? So if anyone offers you a turtle or tortoise, if you can't take it, find someone who can take it because it's gonna do a lot better if a reptile keeper can take it and raise it back up. This turtle, although it does have the dog bite on it, 
tortoise, turtle, whatever tortoise. Although it does have the dog bite on it, it's still got plenty of energy. It doesn't look like it's oozing, anything like that. I'm gonna go ahead and put some cream and everything on it and uh, make sure it doesn't get infected, but I think it'll make a full recovery for sure. So I'm gonna go ahead and take care of the turtle or tortoise. Man, I'm just botching that, guys. So I got turtles, I got tortoises, we got everything. But guys, if you could do me a solid, click that like button, click subscribe if you're still here. If you made it this far in the video, you are an OG. Post and let me know down below. I will reply to your comment, I promise you. But I appreciate you guys. We'll have another video coming real soon for you. You guys have an absolutely wonderful time, and I'll catch you next time. So I just wanted to add something onto this video. It's the next day I'm going to be uploading the video today. Um, I wanted to make sure I emphasize I am not saying you should only rescue a turtle or tortoise. I think it's totally fine if you buy a baby tortoise um, from a reputable source, and that's totally cool. I just think if someone presents the opportunity to rescue, you should definitely do it. Help get it in a better environment. But again, go buy a baby tortoise, buy a baby tortoise, buy a baby turtle. It's all good. But guys, appreciate you. Click that like button, click subscribe, and we'll catch you next time.